You got any M thing and D thing stories? I got a, uh, a D thing. <clears throat> D thing story, uh, M thing and D thing brother, uh, Trigger, that's my man's, my man's. Um, he just slid through this motherfucker, fucking with me, man. Um, I was actually out there when D thing got killed. When D thing got killed, I was standing on the block, but I was down the street, some. You know what I'm saying? He got killed on the corner. I was like in the middle of the block and shit. Uh. The day, the vibe was off, all type of crazy ass shit. Motherfucker slid through, blew. He ended up losing his life. Um, and we was all out there with each other. Trig had just walked off. He walked back up and seen his brother dead, man. The look in his face and his eyes. That shit just was so crazy, man. You can see the pain, man. Um, but the D thing was a, uh, you know. Um, a firecracker. He did what he did, man. And you know, one time he told me, "I'ma listen to you, OG." And other than that, though, he did what he do. It did, man. You heard what happened, or like, did you hear it, or? I heard the shots. Poop, poop, pow, pow. I turn around, I see two niggas running and shit. Then I see a nigga with a wig, all type of shit, man. And as they hit the cut. I walk to the corner and I see him, you know what I'm saying, down there, holding his stomach and all that shit, man. I guess that's what a bullet hole is doing. Damn. Damn. How you feel like that affected the area? Man, the area went up because it was just a peace treaty before that happened. It was a peace treaty. As me and a couple of the other gang members, I was gang banging at that time, walked over and tried to get peace. So this murder happened during a peace treaty. You feel what I'm saying? Yeah. Shit.